For as yet you have not come to the rest, and the inheritance which the Lord your God has given you. This is not your rest. There remains therefore a rest for the people of God. Behind the veil where the forerunner has entered for us, even Jesus. In my Father's house are many mansions. If it were not so, I would have told you. I go to prepare a place for you. And if I go and prepare a place for you, I will come again and receive you to myself, that where I am, there you may be also. With Christ, which is far better. God will wipe away every tear from their eyes. There shall be no more death, nor sorrow, nor crying. There shall be no more pain. For the former things have passed away. There the wicked cease from troubling, and there the weary are at rest. Lay up for yourselves treasures in heaven, for where your treasure is, there your heart will be also. Set your mind on things above, not on things on the earth. O oh, death, <laughs> where is your sting? O oh, Hades, where is your victory? The sting of death is sin. Now once at the end of the ages, he has appeared to put away sin by the sacrifice of himself. And as it is appointed for men to die once, but after this the judgment, so Christ was offered once to bear the sins of many. To those who eagerly wait for him, he will appear a second time, apart from sin, for salvation. Inasmuch then as the children have partaken of flesh and blood, he himself likewise shared in the same, that through death he might destroy him who had the power of death, that is, the devil, and release those who through fear of death were all their lifetime subject to bondage. The time of my departure is at hand. I have fought the good fight. I have finished the race. I have kept the faith. Finally, there is laid up for me the crown of righteousness, 